shit can we do? Ready for a train? Legging all the shit ones. And our new light. It's a fish. She's cute. Next big decision that we've got to make is what do we do to the new floor tiles that Eleonora made for us. So these have been laid and grouted and we've brought one out to show. Once they get grouted and wet, they take on a slightly different colour to the original, original colour. And the Tyler has provided us with two examples of what he can do. Example one, here, a little bit light. We couldn't put that side by side the bedrooms because um, they just won't match. This is his second option, um, which this was one of our original tiles. I've just cleaned it so it is a little bit wet. But as you can see, this is a little bit, this is closer to that. So Phil and I have got a big decision on which way to go. We weren't 100% happy with the last two samples. One was too brown and the other was too pale. So Luke has gone to another contractor and he's given us three more samples. We've chosen the one in the middle. We think that'll blend the best with what we've got. From the original tiles. We've come to the end of, we think it's about week seven. Yeah, I think it's week seven. Hi everyone, by the way. And we have floors on both levels and floors are grouted. And Phil and I are here today to start cleaning because the guy that's going to come in and seal the new terracotta tiles, they need to be completely cleaned before he comes in and seals them. So we've been given that job and we're going to start cleaning. Yeah, so all the tiling's done, not without dramas. I'm not gonna go into it. There's been a bit of a delay, but the main thing is that- They're done now. They're pretty much done now. They're so. done now. All right. So all that is now for the boys to do fill 
is the electrician needs to come in and fit off all the power points. The guys are going to come in and just finish off some, some rendering, some rough spots that need to be fixed up in the second bedroom where the, uh, they removed the tiles on the ground. They also chipped off some, some, wall, some plaster on the wall, so that needs to be repaired. Um, so yeah, what, what did I say? Fitting off of the Fitting off the electrical. electrical Repairing, there's a the patch down here that needs to be repaired. Some minor wall. Marks. And we need one piece of of stone of marble, oh, marble. in down front here. of the toilet. Um, so, yeah, it's going to be a lot of cleaning, but it's I can't wait to get back in. So, how long do you reckon before we actually physically move in? We're estimating a week and a half. Yeah, I think. yeah, I think so. Um, so once a guy comes in and does the treatment. He's going to want a couple of days to perform the treatment and then one, one or two days for everything to dry. And then we're good to go and then we can start. We've already started planning the kitchen design. That's proven to be a nightmare because of... Sorry, again, excuse the light. This is going to be hopefully an appliance cupboard with a bit of a bench here. So this little alcove is proven to be a little bit problematic but we'll get we'll sort it out we'll sort it out yeah but uh, yeah so other than that we're nearly there guys we are nearly there nearly there whilst in Arezzo this week we wanted to go and have a look at the frescoes in the Basilica di San Francesco you'll remember these from the movie The English Patient we hope you enjoy looking at this church as much as we did whilst we were there
Where are you? So, Mr. Fish has been brought back to life. All we're going to do is, that's the lampshade that came with it, but it's a little bit dirty, so we're going to give that a good clean. And we put a globe in and watch. Oh my God. How lovely is it, Mr. Fish? Now, there's one thing I wanted to do since I saw the video back. Well, cleaning him, I just wanted to brush his teeth. There you go. That's much better. So next time you see this guy, it'll be in the townhouse, not here, in the townhouse, on a beautiful piece of furniture, and uh, he's going to look divine. You've done a great job, huh? Thank you. He is very cute. By the way, everyone, thanks for subscribing, thanks for watching, thanks for liking, thanks for commenting, and notifications. Don't forget, there's a separate video that Claire's done on notifications. I've got to go because my neck is killing me in this position. See ya. Thank <laughs> you.